Yo guys, it's Saro. You already know, welcome back to another episode of our Digimon World Let's Play. I don't know why I almost stumbled through saying that, but we are here, we are back, and um, I'm not entirely sure. I think I did some training off screen, I don't know, you, see, you can see some stats there and whatnot, but if you do remember, on the last episode, Bay did Digivolve, and he Digivolved into Tyranomon, which is pretty freaking awesome, as well as uh, we were carrying some things of dirt. So uh, we're going to do some more carrying of the dirt, but first we're going to go and get our meat for the day because we need to eat. Also, I would like to say that this is actually the first episode that I'm recording since um, the first episode like came out. So basically the first three episodes were all recorded before I even like uploaded the first video. Um, so like I haven't been able to see like feedback things like that so this is the first one that I'm able to say thank you guys so much for the support so far um, I didn't realize that this game was as nostalgic for a lot of other people as it is for me um, I don't know I just I, I kind of thought this was like one of those games that was like just like like oh this is my childhood and like no one knows about this but like I'm really really happy uh, uh, with the amount of people that have been like yo I love this game like oh man I remember this game and so and, uh, yeah, I'm just really happy with just, like, all the, like, the different response I've gotten for it. So, thank you, thank you so much. Uh, it gets me even more hyped to play this game, um, than I already was before, knowing that you guys enjoy it. Um, yeah. So, we're gonna go back into the cave. Uh, well, not the cave. This is the cave, the drill tunnel, or whatever. What have you call it? And we are going to carry the rest of the dirt, because... There is a Digimon um, through here that we do need to get. Um, I think he's, pre he's pretty much our, our next target. Um, there is one, two, there are about two to three, one, all right, I guess one to three Digimon that I will get, uh, or I will attempt to get this episode. Um, oh, snap. Do we even carry any of the dirt? Hello? We carried dirt last episode, right? Yeah, yeah, we did. Because he didn't explain everything. Dang, we have so much dirt to carry. Dang. So, yeah, we're just going to go back and forth. Um, I don't know. I feel like I should <laughs> I feel like I should speed up, honestly. Um, but I probably won't. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. If I do decide to speed up, this is basically what we're going to be doing. Back and forth. Back and forth. Over and over and over and over. So, it's not very, it's not very exciting, but it is what it is. Um, the thing about this... Um, dumping of the dirt and carrying of the dirt is that it actually boosts our stats like a good amount and we get paid that dollar dollar bills y'all so we're gonna get rich quick we're going to get um we're gonna get get what was i gonna say uh, i'm gonna get buff i what was I gonna say we're gonna, we're gonna lift that's what I, I think i was going for like a lift like we're gonna start lifting and uh look at that 500 bits HP is up by 50, offense, defense goes up. That's basically what we've been focusing on anyway. Um, so it's all really, really good. It's all really, really good. And um, I think it's funny. I don't know why I decided to mention this, but I actually um, have enjoyed playing this game so much that I actually started a second file to play just for fun and to just mess around and whatnot alongside of my LP. So I'm actually playing this twice. That's how much I really... I'm into playing this game is I'm basically let's playing it with myself if that makes sense um a lot of times when you see someone LP a game like you kind of are like oh man I really want to play that too and so you start playing it that's that's I think kind of where the idea of like a let's play um came up you know with is you're seeing someone else play and you're like oh I want to play too and um yeah I basically did that too I started playing and I was like yo I don't want to stop but I don't want to like you know keep recording and everything too especially if it's like I don't if I'm not you know no, no, no. if like the house too loud or um if I don't know maybe maybe uh like I'm on Skype with somebody and like I don't want to leave just to, like record because I already have plenty of recorded like and I just want to play Digimon World just for fun or maybe I just want to mess around do something like I can do that so it's it's pretty funny that I've, I'm actually basically LPing it uh, with myself. I think if we want to make any progress in this game, um, I'm probably going to have to speed up uh, this footage. So honestly, I'm just going to speed it up starting now. Alright, 
So, um, I think I, I just decided to cut that out, um, because it was just me running back and forth for like five minutes, and I still is taking up precious time, um, for things that I want to do. So as you can see, this place is now, uh, is now open. I thought you had to get all the dirt, but, uh, apparently not. There's still a bit of a dirt pile. I think that may be a glitch. I'm not entirely sure. But, yes, this is now open. However, there's one more obstacle in the way, and that is this boulder. Shoot! We hit a big rock! I can't drill through! You can't? Oh no! We gotta figure out how to move it. Can you do it? I don't know. Bay, I need your help. Bay's just like, hey, I got this. Bam. You know what's funny is, like, I think it would take a while, but I'm pretty sure, like, basically any Digimon will be able to move that rock. It's pretty funny. Like, a rookie can do it and stuff like that. Wow, amazing power. We moved the rock. I think it's empty past this point. Bam. There is a Digimon in here that we do need to fight. However, I am going to wait. The reason for that is uh, a couple of things. Uh, we do have a decent amount of recovery items. I could probably use more. Um, and my stats aren't quite as high as I want them. Well, uh, you know what? They actually aren't too bad. But if I get bopped... If I get bopped, though, that would be really bad. I mean, it's only my health. I have 21. You know what? We might just go for it. We might as well just go for it. We're already here. Oh, snap. Let's uh, let's feed him, though, first. My goodness. But I have 21 small recoveries. I think, I think, uh, from what I remember, um, this Digimon isn't as hard as I always think that he is. So, yeah, let's just do it. Do you still need food? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Alright, so we're about to get into our first fight. And then there are two other Digimon that I would like to be able to recruit uh, this episode as well. Assuming that we win this fight. I really, really hope that we do. I'm um, not entirely sure that we will. But we do have three lives to play with. However, yeah, it's best not to waste them. But, you know, whatever. Because uh, it messes with your tamer level, which messes with how good your Digimon will be when it like your when it dies and you get a new egg and things like that. Oh, what happened to the island? I can't do. Marimon's voice in the anime is like one of the best voices ever. I love it so much. It's so intense. Tries to apart, losing memories and becoming wild. I don't know how long it stays sane. We can't leave it like this. We must realize the danger. Marimon is probably one of the coolest Digimon. Of all time. Of all time. One of my favorites. Not my absolute favorite, but he's definitely like top ten. For sure. Stop, do you want to ruin the island? Who are you? Move out of my way, this is the only way. Bump da bum. Bump da bum bow. Yeah, when you hear that intense music, you know that it is on like Donkey Kong, except for we are not playing Donkey Kong. Um, however, we only have our little sonic jab attack, which means that this battle could take a while. He does have twenty six hundred health. Um, the th good thing about what he's doing is that I believe he knows a lot of the attacks that we can learn and if we see him use some of these attacks in battle we may actually pick up some um, at the end of the battle. Um, I really want us to learn a new move so you can so you can kind of see it instead of me just like telling you. But yeah, it'll be like at the end it'll be like Marimon drops whatever chip he drops and then it'll be like Bay learned, uh, you know, dynamic or dynamite kick or whatever. I, I think that's one of the moves. There's a couple things. All right, I'm gonna wait. Bam! Come on. Oh, oh, snap! All right, he turned me into a flat thing. I don't understand what the status condition is and like why it exists. Um, I'm gonna move you up here and I'm gonna use you. But yeah, I don't understand what the status condition is and like why it exists. But there we go. Charge up that special by alternating R1, L1. Oh, I did not do as much as I wanted to, but that still did a lot. 869? That's way more than I thought it would do. But that is fine. I may be able to build up another one. Okay, so he's going to use his, but he's going to do probably somewhere between 500 and 1,000. 941, yeah. That's about what I expected. That's why I always try to keep my health up. Um, against him, I definitely want to keep it up above 1,000 to 1,500. Um, just to be safe, just to be safe. That way I can make sure that I get to the uh, this recovery item in time um, without, you know, without chancing it. Because I don't want to chance it. Like I said, I do have three lives. If I would if I would die, you just go back to File City and it's like, oh, you should be more careful. 
good thing he was okay, blah, blah, blah. Uh, it's only after he dies three times in battle is that you, like, officially lose him forever, and then you have to start with a new egg and things like that, which I'm actually pretty excited to start with a new egg once we get to that point. However, there is a lot of things that we can do um, through our first, like, with our first champion um, and with our first Digimon. There is a lot of ground we can cover, and I'd like to be able to cover most of that ground. This should be the end of Marimon. Bam, we did more than last time. 903. That's going to be a KO. That was way easier than I thought it would be. So that is pretty awesome. Our stats should go up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Me. That means Marimon's going to drop something. Offense chip. We did not learn to move. Dang it. That really sucks. Hey, tell me there's another way. Where's Rachel? The island is ruined. It defeats the purpose. Listen to me. What? We're building a city for the island by gathering all Digimon. I heard that we can save the island from the danger by uniting Digimon. I think you're right by gathering all the Digimon. That's a big... We're working on it right now. Nothing is impossible. That's a big job, but, it may... but I'm moving. Maybe you guys can do it. Dang, right? We can do it? If you believe in us, I want you to come to the city. All right, I'll go to the city. I guess that's my new path. So Marimon is going to join the city, and we got ourselves another Digimon into our city, which is powerful. What he does is he actually opens up a restaurant, um, so you can have other ways to feed your Digimon. And the restaurant food, oh, medicine, and an offense chip. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, uh, also, with the restaurant food, you can... Um, it'll restore tiredness sometimes, or... It will, some of them will even boost your stats a little bit, things like that. It's pretty cool. But uh, it does cost money, which, you know, if you don't have a lot of money going around, it's not necessarily the best thing. I don't personally use the restaurant all that much. What you got? Hey, how are you? Yeah, they, they uh, the Demi Marimon don't attack you. Demi Marimons also look really cool. I wish they were something that I could, uh, that I could use. But there are a bunch of items just scattered through this uh, lava cave. And uh, I only know that because of recent, uh, previous experience, they all say something like, Lava is hard, you know, something just random one-liners of blah, blah, blah. You still hot, some Digimon can't handle the heat and get sick. That is actually good. If you see at the bottom right my happiness thing, you see that he's really happy um, because of his face like that. That's because, you know, he likes the heat and things like that. Um, if we take him to a cold environment, he's not going to like that. However, there are Digimon that are the opposite that enjoy cold environments and not hot environments and baby Digimon do not like either <laughs> special defense disc yeah there's a lot of wins we're getting right here what do you say do you know about Digimon cards I collect Marimon cards bring one and I'll buy it for 1500 bits all right we'll have to remember that um, I'm not sure if I have told you guys I think I did I showed you the thing but yeah you can get Digimon cards um, it's part of 100 percenting the game um, things like that um, getting all the medals, getting all the cards, you know, getting the whole chart filled out. Um, which brings me to something that I was going to ask you guys about earlier, is how much of this game do you want me to do? Do you want me to just beat the main plot? Um, do you want me to recruit all the Digimon? Do you guys want me to try and 100% of the game, like get all the different Digimon, things like that? Um, if I do try to like completely 100% of the game, most of it probably won't be shown on screen, like me just aiming to get certain Digimon, things like that. I, I don't really see the point in having a bunch of training um, up on the screen, but I don't know, I don't know. Uh, but do you want me to just kind of beat the game, or do you want me to try and recruit all the Digimon? Um, that will be something that I will most likely try and do. There are some that are just very optional, that are like very out of the way. There's some that only show up like a small percentage of the time in very specific spots. Things like that. So, but if you want me to try and get all of them, let me know, and I will do that. Uh, if you guys just want me to kind of beat it, you know, and just play through it casually, let me know that as well. I'm down for either, because I'm probably going to go for a full 100% of this game on my personal uh, thing. But you'll see that this path is now opened, and we are going to save that perhaps for tomorrow. Nah, no, 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 not tomorrow. But... Probably next episode we'll start going that way because there are two more Digimon that I would like to get this episode. However, I think... Actually, I'm probably tired. I hauled a bunch of dirt and um, fought a Digimon, fought a champion level Digimon. 
And uh, you'll see the item shops right there. You know, let's actually buy some more stuff. We might as well. Let's buy some small recoveries. Alright, I think we can't buy anything that we don't already have because we're probably out of item spots. We'll probably go to the item bank and whatnot. There's the restaurant. Uh, we're not going to go inside. There's a graphical glitch. Hello. Hello, Mr. Graphical Glitch. Nice to meet you. But, um... Yeah, what was I going to say? I don't know. We can go to the item bank right quick. And then I might rest for an hour or two until he goes to sleep. And then when we wake up, we are going to get two more Digimon. Well, we're definitely going to get two more Digimon by the end of uh, the episode. So, yeah. Offensive chip. I got three offensive chips in that in that cave. That's powerful. Um, I don't know what protection does. We don't need equip chip. Disc is like it uh, ups your thing for battle. So it's not the same as a chip. So I will keep that with me. I may need it. I may need it. But if there's like some hardcore trap music remix of this of this like song, <laughs> now it's nighttime. Yeah, let's rest. Why not? And then we might get an hour of training in, just because. Nope, he's sleepy. He's super sleepy. All right, we're gonna sleep. Good afternoon. He sounds like he's saying good afternoon. He's like good afternoon. I don't know. He's probably saying something in Japanese. I don't know. Who knows? Go to sleep. Go to sleep. And we are going to go back across the bridge um, where we found Quellamon, things like that. And uh, there are a couple of Digimon over there we need to go get. Three pieces of giant meat. Blah, blah, blah. Cool. Actually, uh, I totally. I got Betamon, right? Yeah, yeah. I got Betamon last episode, I think. Oh, it's so hard to keep track of who I did and didn't get. Yep, there's Betamon, there's Quellamon. The glitch is gone! The glitch is gone! Alright, let's go over here, though. And I'm really scared about this part. Uh, there is a part of this game that I absolutely hate. However, I did do it just recently in my personal playthrough uh, that I've been doing like alongside this. And I actually had to look up a walkthrough of how to get through it without dying. So uh, let's see if we can do that. Let us see if we can do that. I think I remember the pattern. I really hope I do. Because if I don't, uh, it's going to suck. It's going to suck so much. But alright, so we need to go to the right. And now, we are in the mangrove region. Which is cool. We need to not get attacked by that Yanma looking thing. Spray the shadow, bam. Dodging Digimon is like a, is like a life-saving skill in this game. Oh my goodness. Bam. Alright, so we got past him. And uh, now we're in the Amida Forest. What is the Amida Forest? Oh, uh, snap. Trespasser alert. I will shoot. So, if I remember, you go left. Yeah. Okay. And then you go right here. Up here. Oh, let's get this piece of meat. Go right there. And then I don't know. Oh, right there. No, that's not how you do it. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Yeah, uh, if you get caught, you get shot. And uh, he, our Digimon loses a lot of, uh, of health. So I'm going to give him a recovery item to heal some health to make sure. Um, thank goodness this doesn't actually count as like a death if anything happens. So we're going to go there. And we're going to go there. Yeah! Um, if we would die, it goes down to 1 HP. And then when it goes down to 1 HP, it like forces us to leave the forest. That's basically all it is. So you don't actually ever die um, in this forest, which is really good. But we've made it to the circle, so let's see what happens. Find out who's been shooting us. It's none other than Sentarumon. It's amazing that you made it through the forest. I am Sentarumon. I'm sorry for what I did. I didn't test you for fun. I want to work with you. Go on, I'll stay in the city. So, bam, we didn't even need to say anything, and he just hops along to the city. Centaurmon is also really cool. That's a really cool Digimon. Bam, I think we're getting pretty famous. Let's keep it up. Hey, we got that 301 plus. We got that fame. True, though. All right, so now we're going to get ambushed again, kind of like Agumon. We got Tyranomon. What? what? Who's Tyranomon is who? What? Oh, my goodness. Who are you? I won't let anyone mess up this place. 
Don't worry, we're just traveling through the, to save the island. I don't trust you, get lost. Wait a sec. And that music, of course, means that this is an important battle. Um, I did kind of lie. I said that we would recruit two Digimon. We don't actually get to recruit him right away. Um, Tyranimon is a recruitable Digimon for the further future. So, but we will we'll come back to that. We'll, we'll, we'll come back to that. It is important to get to, to just fight him. And I know that we have the power to fight him now. Also, the fact that we are going against uh, another Tyranimon means that every single move that this Tyranimon mo uses is something that we can learn. So there's a very high chance that we will learn some, uh, learn a new move, which is good because we need to learn something other than freaking Sonic Jab or the stupid punch thing. Like, it does nothing. doesn't matter how, my, how high my attack is, it still is going to do basically nothing. Also, he's raising his own stats. I don't know if that's his attack strength or if that is defense or what that is. I'm kind of scared what all he's going to do let's try and hit him with a finisher yes we got him before he attacks us if you start to use a finisher and they attack you uh you won't be able to use your finisher and you'll have to work you have to spell finish all over again it's so annoying all right 845 that does do a lot of damage but we've been pretty fast and uh been pretty good at not letting him attack us very much who okay that is a rock that didn't actually do too much that rock move, I don't know what it's called, but it's really good for when you're battling multiple enemies because it, uh, you, you shoot out like three rocks. So, and uh, yeah, there are going to be times where we battle more than one Digimon at a time. Um, there's actually one um, recurring enemy villain thing that uh, is basically every single time you have to fight like three Digimon at a time. And it's super annoying. I'm sure we'll get to it sooner than later. But, alright. Uh, we do have another finisher. I'm going to wait. There we go. Can we pull it off? Yes, we can. Yes, we can. Bob the Builder. Yes, we can. Alright, that did a little over half. So, give it another minute or two. And we are going to be done. We are going to make this Tyranomon go extinct. Not our own. But his, the good thing about having this only like Sonic Jab thing is that it barely uses up any MP. I haven't had to use any MP recoveries because it, it takes up so little because it's not very a powerful move. But yeah, it is what it is. All right, the rock thing. All right, come on. What's that? Like four more hits? Bam. All right, well, maybe more now. Dude, we're so good at defending these rocks. But yeah, they keep doing rah, 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 rah. I got you. I got you, though. You can, you can. You can stop doing that. Alright, can we finish you off with a finisher? Nope. There we go. I just demonstrated to you that he will interrupt your finisher. Finisher goes away. We don't get to use it, but eh, it's no big deal in this situation. Whoo! 799. Alright. Yeah! Small recovery still went out. Get da! Did we learn anything? Please tell me we did. Tyrannomon dropped HP chip. <gasps> Warcry learned. Oh. Warcry is the thing that he was doing that was like raising stats or whatever. Are you by any chance? I told you so. I'm sorry we don't get visitors often so I get, I, I get excited about my new job. Job? I'm guarding a place called Ancient Dino Region. It's an unexplored region. Will you show me around? Ancient Dino Region is divided into two sections. Where we live is called Glacial Time Zone. It's a special place where time goes slow. Time goes slow? The other place is Speedy Time Zone. It's dangerous and further than Glacial Time Zone. It's dangerous because time goes very fast. I also love how they say cause and not like because or they don't spell like cause. Like they just say cause. The land is bare. Boons and fossils everywhere. Hey, that rhymed. That's because time passes faster there than in other places. Right, don't stay there long. Since I'm blocking you away, you can't go there. You lost. I was unlucky. It doesn't happen often. Is that right? I have to go back home. Ask other Digimon a few questions. Alright, I think we have spent enough time uh, here. Ooh, ooh, let's get that chip though. Um, yeah, we have spent enough time in this episode, so after I pick up that chip and I feed Bay here, um, I am actually going to end the episode. Um, I'm just going to uh, off screen, I'm going to walk uh, back to File City, probably going to train for a bit more, uh, decide what the next plan of action is, and then uh, we're going to do it. We're probably going to go up that mountain thing. Um, to the left, 
that I that the uh, the path was unlocked or whatever. We'll probably start going up that way because there are a couple of Digimon we can get that way. So yeah, we're gonna go exploring that way on the next time. So but if you enjoyed this episode, make sure you let me know in the comment section below. Wait, you're still hungry, right? <laughs> Uh, make sure you uh, hit the like button and everything. Show your support. It always means the world. The Digimon world. What? And uh, that's going to be everything. And it's a pleasant day as always. And until the next time, guys, stay sly.